what I want. <laughs> Open sesame. Okay, that didn't work. On to plan B. Lunch with young Mr. Osborne was most enlightening. I'm authorizing all requested funds to finance the special task force we discussed. A scheduled dinner with the chief of police so that I may put to rest any concerns he might have. Tell him I'd like to see the personnel files of all suitable candidates on the force. Disciplinary problems are not an issue. Oh, and find out how much Oscorp stock is available for purchase. Uh, discreetly. I believe Harry Osborne may prove unfit to act as CEO much longer. Who can resist that? I can check that one off my list. You won't get me so easily, Spider! Deliberately moving really slowly? Is this like some sort of mime thing? I see you! Come on, show me what you got! smelly sweater. Saved Fisk from the Russians. Now to find out if I have to save anyone else from him. Everyone's got an angle. That's what Daddy always said. So I know there's a catch. But the offer the big guy made me, it's too good to pass up. A get-out-of-jail-free card, money, and best of all, power. Real power. The kind Spider-Man has. I'll be playing in the majors at last. That's the other thing Daddy said. In this world, there are winners and losers. This is my chance to be a winner. The price doesn't matter. I'm going to do it. Time to mingle. See what these big shots have to say about what's going on. The police must really be desperate if they're working with Fisk and Oscorp, given their reputations. The 
problem is the games have all this money. Please have to deal with budget cuts. <laughs> what did that lunatic with the robots call himself? A spider slayer? <laughs> well, uh, send flowers to his widow. We've made a handsome profit repairing the damage he caused to this city. <laughs> However, this may expose us to an unacceptably high tax burden. We will reduce said profits by redirecting them to a non-profit organization, the Ravencroft Institute for the Criminally Insane. In addition to the tax benefits, our funding arrangement with Ravencroft could yield some interesting medical breakthroughs. Very interesting indeed. So, uh, this is gonna sound like a bad pickup line, but you seem really familiar. Have we met? Judging from your bargain basement suit, I doubt we move in the same circles. Oh, no, I get it. One with a silver spoon in your mouth, huh? <laughs> Hardly. For me, silver's an acquired oh, taste. Uh, well, uh, I'm here for the Daily Bugle, so, uh, you know anything interesting about Fisk? I know he hangs out with rich, older men, and you're scaring him off, so I'll have to say goodbye. <laughs> Look me up when you move out of your mom's basement. I don't live with my mom. I live with my aunt. Well, nice meeting you. Um, my name's Peter. As if you care. I'm Felicia. But what? How to make an entrance? Blotting out the sun. Time to talk to the big man himself. Should I tell Whitney Chang he has no comment on the Russian mobsters tied up downstairs? It's all right. I like this young man's boldness. He mustn't reveal that to anyone. It would play into the criminals' hands. They want to make people afraid to support my anti-crime efforts. But if no one knows what they did, they'll get away with it. And try again. Oh, I assure you, they will not get away with it. Meaning what, exactly? <laughs> well, the, the task force will get them, of course. <laughs> We've been gathering intelligence on this organization for some time. But no one's been able to stop them yet. Not the police, not Spider-Man. Don't say that name to me! Spider-Man. He fancies himself a hero. But he's let crime run rampant. The police are bound by the laws of probable cause. Spider-Man is not. If he hasn't stopped this scum by now, he's either incompetent... ...or he simply doesn't care. What's your beef with Spider-Man? Seems like you're after the same thing. If Spider-Man is going to operate outside the law, one would think he can accomplish things more... expediently. But he contents himself with apprehending purse snatchers. He's a dilettante. A thrill-seeker. Worse than useless. Still, he does seem popular with children. 
In fact, I recently secured his likeness rights. <laughs> you what? Gathering intelligence, huh? Find out anything interesting? The Russians are clever. They operate in cells, each knowing very little about the others. <laughs> when one group is taken down, it rarely leads to further arrests. But someone's got to be calling the shots. Well, they do have a central base of operations, but very few know where it is. Finding it will be another matter entirely. <laughs> How about this Carnage Killer? Is the task force chasing him? We are interested in catching anyone who commits a crime. But it's a lot harder to find one man than an entire gang of them. And I bet the fact he's killing guys you don't like doesn't exactly bother you. I do not condone murder, of course. But am I shedding tears for his victims? <laughs> no, I am not. It's this very war that will be the end of the gangs. The more they escalate, the harder it becomes for them to hide. Wait, are you saying the Russians are still smuggling guns into the city? Don't put words in my mouth, young man. I'm just the backer. I leave the crime fighting to train professionals. Now, excuse me. I have funds to raise. Yeah, I've got, uh, important things to do, too. I found showed a lot of Russian mob activity around a trucking company. Seems like the perfect cover for bringing weapons into the city. Today only. Order a truckload of weapons, get one Spider-Man at no extra charge. I sure wish some dude dressed up like a spider would help me not get killed! Hint, hint! I came along. Traffic? Shaken victim said, if Spider-Man hadn't been there, I don't know what would have happened.
It's my lucky day. Quick, before those task force idiots see us. Relax. We set a car on fire ten blocks away. They're distracted by that. I haven't done this kind of heavy lifting in years. Uh, me neither. But there's a reason we've lasted this long. Not many of our soldiers even know about this place. Yeah, here. I guess everyone's a big shot. Is it true what they say about the killer? Is he one of the cross species? I heard he is just a man. If that's true, Jack the Ripper was just a man. I am telling you, there is something demonic about anyone who could do that to a human being. <laughs> 